<laughs> Yo, what's up my fellow creatives? I discovered seven tools that are so good, it's bananas. Yes, don't mind the shirt. Literally seven tools that you can install and you can work with using AI that are gonna blow your mind. So let's jump right into them. All right, the first one here is called SciSpace Copilot. This is an AI research assistant. You can do hours worth of reading and understanding in literally minutes. You just install this on here and you can see you're simplifying technical language in a lot of industries, especially in graphic design, web design, there's a lot of technical language. This is gonna help you understand it. So it's gonna be able to simplify it for you. There's the overview. If you wanna check it out, all you gotta do is go to SciSpace Copilot within the extensions on the Chrome Web Store. If you're using Chrome, this is going to be a huge deal for you. I'm installing this, in fact, right now. We're gonna go ahead and add it to my Chrome so that you guys can see firsthand. And you can see here there's some reviews. The reviews of this thing are absolutely insane. You can check it out here. You got 87 reviews already and almost five stars. 90,000 users that are using this thing. It's kind of like a secret weapon. All right, so that's number one. The second one here is Flyerflies, Flyer, Fireflies.ai. This tool is to help you capture and transcribe your meetings. It works with Zoho. Uh, it works with Google Meet. It works with Zoom. It works with all these different tools and it's basically going to transcribe your meetings. So if you look here, some of the biggest brands are using it. You may be using Fathom, you may be using Otter, but for me personally, I'm going to be using Fireflies.ai. It automates your meeting notes and catches specific things in your conversations. You can see here companies like Uber and Delta and Nike and Expedia are already using this, but you can see here these highlighted words like next steps. It's AI artificially intelligent. Transcribe your meetings across several video conferencing apps, dialers, and even audio files. Easily invite Fireflies.ai note taker into your meetings like your Zoom calls. And then Fireflies captures video and audio and generates the transcript in minutes. And then integrates with Google Meet, Zoom, Teams like Microsoft Teams, WebEx, Ring Central, AirCall, and tons of other platforms. And it's just going to allow you to really get the most out of your meetings. You can set date and times and tasks. And you can see they asked about questions or pricing. Right, so lots of really neat things. This is another one you gotta check out. This is a huge one. All right, the next one is use chat GPT AI. Are you ready to level up your daily work and your internet browsing? This is kind of like chat GPT on steroids. It supports chat GPT, Bard, Bing, and Claude all at the same time. And you have to do is just add this to your Chrome. So if you're gonna use this, you just go to use chat GPT.ai, add this to your Chrome browser, which we'll go ahead and do right now. You can see I can add it for free. It'll make it very quick. Let's see here, redirecting to the extension. It's gonna take a few seconds. Look at that, number one product of the week on Product Hunt. This is a game changer, here we go. I'm gonna go ahead and install this right now, add to Chrome, and I'm gonna start using this on a regular basis, and I'll probably make some more videos individually on how I'm using each one of these going forward. All right, the next one here, just for the sake of time, is Monica. Monica is your chat GBT co-pilot in Chrome as well, but this translates, rephrases, and summarizes your text on any web page instantly. So it's gonna really take a lot of the technical and make it simple. So you can see here what you get with the free, for ChatGPT free plan versus what the plus, right? And then what they're able to do here. So you can see here, use your own ChatGPT to power the extension. So you just do an API right in from OpenAPI, which is ChatGPT, and you can plug this thing right in here. Um, one thing I'll also tell you, daily free usage, and it, uh, it's as fast as ChatGPT Plus. So if you don't have the Plus one, you're not paying for it, this is a really good option for you, and it generates copywriting using 80 plus different templates. So this is a really, really cool deal. All right, so the next one here is Wise One. Wise One, I was kind of scrolling through each of these and doing my research, enriching your online reading experience. So Apple launches end-to-end -end encryption for iCloud data. This is gonna allow you to see sources on that information so that you know the information you're providing to people is reliable, right? So this is another Chrome extension that you can add. It's in beta mode right now. Um, one of the things I wanna mention, it's a chat GPT assistant for reading and exploring information and helps you master any topic that you're reading online by bringing relevant and reliable information. You wanna be able to have references and cite sources when you're giving away information. You can see here down on the page, you can see here, so like this thing, Qualcomm Ventures, right? Or Our Crowd. You can click on that Our Crowd and it'll show you what Our Crowd is so you can learn more and go deeper with these types of things. All right, the next one is Compose. AI. Compose.ai is another Chrome extension. I should have just made this all about Chrome extensions, but this is another AI, AI Chrome extension that's gonna help you write faster. If you've ever been in Gmail and you start writing out an email and it starts giving you some of those words, that is AI doing semantics. Now, semantics is a really powerful tool that Google's starting to roll out more and more. 
The trick is, is Google could actually write your entire emails for you because they know so much about you. You don't even need to write them anymore, but they've kind of been limiting that to not freak out the public. With this tool, this is gonna allow you to do a lot of the same things, even rephrase some of your content. So like you can see, you can compose anything, right? And outlines, different things like that. You have the autocomplete. So as you're typing it out, it'll finish the sentence for you. You can rephrase your sentences, which I really like. If you don't like the way you wrote that or you get some suggestions of how you could write that better, right? It's gonna give you those suggestions. You can compose your emails. You can reply to emails easier. easier. So this one extension is gonna help you save a lot of time. And that's really what I love and care about is helping you guys get your time back and give you more freedom. That's what I'm all about is giving freedom for creatives. So that's what our passions and our values are is we wanna have more freedom. All right, so the next one here, let me just jump over to it, is perplexity.ai. And I just wanted to do a little test on this one, so I got it all lined up. I just asked it, what was, I, was Einstein's theory of relativity, relativity ever proven? And look at this. Yes, Einstein's theory of relativity has been proven to be correct through a range of precise tests. Each one of these is a source. Scientific America, SciTech Daily, uh, India Times, right? These are all sources. Einstein's theory of general relativity has been around for more than a century and has been tested to a, a remarkable degree of accuracy. Here's another scientific source from Scientific America. So these are all going to give you cite, cited sources. This is also very much like ChatGPT, but it's going to give you sources in the answer. So if you're not using ChatGPT and you're looking for an AI tool, this could be a really good one, perplexity.ai. I would check this one out. And with that all being said, uh, I think that's pretty much it. So those are the seven tools that you should be using that are AI tools if you haven't checked these out yet. Again, SciSpace Copilot, Fireflies.ai, use ChatGPT.ai, uh, there's the extension for it. Then we have Monica.im, you have WiseOne.io, you have Compose.ai, and you have perplexity.ai. These are all really good tools. I would love to know if some of you guys are already using these, how have these impacted your business? And if you want more content like this around AI and how you can grow your creative business with AI, let me know down in the comments, introduce yourself, and make sure you hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you guys on the next video. I'm Adrian Boysell, have fun, God bless, and as always, keep looking up.